Baby bus. Let's go share it, Labrador. <laughs> Vanishing polar bear. Wow, tomorrow is the double skating challenge competition. I'm Reporter Hippo, and I've come to the skating rink to interview the skating star duo, Polar Bear and Husky. Oh, where are they? Reporter Hippo circled the skating rink, but couldn't find Husky or Polar Bear. Just then, Sheriff Labrador walked over. Woof! How are you, Reporter Hippo? Are you here to interview the competitors? <laughs> Sheriff Labrador, why are you here? Oh, well... I'm here. Wait, let me guess. You're here, and Husky and Polar Bear are both missing. <laughs> Don't tell me. <laughs> both of them are terrible criminals, and you've come to arrest them. Huh? What nonsense. Husky is the police station switchboard operator. He has a cold, and he has given me his entry place. Oh, I see. <laughs> oh, uh. reporter Hippo. Did you say that Polar Bear is missing too? Yes, I, I looked around, and I haven't seen him. Oh, that's strange. I just called him on the phone, and nobody answered. Where could he be? Sheriff Labrador asked the animals at the skating rink anxiously. Um, excuse me, sir, um, have you seen Polar Bear? Uh, does anyone know where he went? Polar Bear? Haven't seen him. Don't ask me. Nope. Huh? Oh, Sheriff Labrador, you may not know this, but Polar Bear is a cheeky thief. He often steals my cookies. Puffing with anger, Penguin pointed to his empty cookie box. Uh, yeah, that's right. He borrowed my gloves and cap and still hasn't returned them. My ears have frozen. Ooh. Arctic Fox rubbed her red ears sadly. That's right. And he never buys a ticket to enter the skating rink. He sneaks in every time. But this morning, he didn't buy a ticket. But I caught him in the act of sneaking in. Elk, the owner of the skating rink, was so angry he stomped his feet. Oh, dear. I didn't know that Polar Bear, the skating star, was such a bad person. Reporter Hippo held his microphone tightly with great excitement. Woohoo! This is big news! I must do a Polar Bear interview as soon as possible! <clears throat> um, Reporter Hippo, don't get so excited. Even if you want to do an interview, you must find Polar Bear first. Elk, if Polar Bear didn't buy a ticket, where did he go? I'm not sure. I just heard him muttering. The skating rinks in my hometown in the North Pole are free, he said. He wanted to find a place to practice for free. Hmm. A place to practice for free? But there's only one skating rink in Forestville. Sheriff Labrador frowned. Suddenly, a cold snowflake landed on the tip of his nose. He looked up and saw feather-like snow falling from the sky. Whoa! It's snowing again! <sighs> oh, it's so cold! The river must be frozen! River? Frozen? Huh? <gasps> Could it be? Sheriff Labrador's dark, round eyes suddenly lit up. I know where Polar Bear went. <laughs> uh, hey, wait for me, Sheriff Labrador. Sheriff Labrador led reporter Hippo to the side of the river. A layer of ice had formed on the water. It looked like a natural skating rink. A weak shout came from the middle of the river. Help! Help! It's Polar Bear. Polar Bear, where are you? Help! I'm in the river! Wow! Look, Sheriff Labrador, there's a hole in the ice! Polar Bear has fallen into the river! Quick, let's pull him up! Wait! It's very dangerous to step on thin ice. If the ice breaks, you'll fall into the water! Sheriff Labrador held Reporter Hippo back. Find a rope or a tree branch and let Polar Bear hold on to it. We'll pull him up from the bank! Hippo quickly found a rope. Together, Sheriff Labrador and Hippo pulled the polar bear back up to the bank. They took him to the hospital. Uh, oh. Ah. oh, it was terrible. If you hadn't come in time, I would have drowned. Ah. A frozen river is very dangerous. If you fall into the water, you may suffer from exposure and shock or even drown. It's very dangerous. You're lucky you only caught a cold. <laughs> and your medical fees are only $300. $300? Entrance fee to the skating rink are just $3. Oh, from now on, I'll pay for a ticket to the skating rink. I won't go to the frozen river anymore. 
Mini episode on safety. Woof. You have a cold too, polar bear? Ah, phew! Oh, yes, Husky. Oh, well, how did you get a cold? Achoo! Yesterday, I saw that the river had frozen over, so I walked out onto it. The ice cracked, and I fell into the water. I had a hard time crawling out and almost drowned. Polar bear, how did you catch a cold? Well, I did the same thing as you. <sighs> Frozen rivers are dangerous. That's right. Frozen rivers are very dangerous. Sheriff Labrador's safety talk. Winter is here. Many rivers and lakes have frozen over. But never play on the frozen surfaces. If the ice cracks and you fall in, you may not only freeze, but you may even drown, putting your life in danger. Always be careful. Woof!